Jurassic World was released seven years ago. That's nearly a whole decade. I was 11 when Jurassic World released. Now I'm just old. Considering that Jurassic World dominated my early teens, it's pretty safe to say that I've become nostalgic for a lot of the material surrounding it. I still remember the packaging for the Jurassic World toys. While yes, what was inside was, uh, wasn't the best. I still love this packaging. Well, except for Rex. The Rex looks terrible. I love the red and the blue and the white of the scales. It just looks a lot better than the grey and the red we got with Fallen Kingdom. But like 90% of Hasbro's line was hot garbage. I can't believe I liked it when it came out. The only two good ones were the two Indominus Rexes. But besides that, the rest of these just look terrible. Like the Mosasaurus looks Fine. However, it came out in the final wave, and I saw it in stores once, and happily, I didn't get it. However, the LEGO, the LEGO for Jurassic World was amazing. Like the Indominus Rex paddock, I loved that set growing up. It was my shit, I loved it. Like, I'm pretty sure I still have it. However, it's broken up into pieces, so someday I might try and rebuild it. Like all of the sets for 2015 were amazing. However, I didn't get any of the sets for Fallen Kingdom, except for the one from the original Jurassic Park, which I might rebuild someday as well. And I really regret not getting any of the Fallen Kingdom sets, because Lockwood's Manor looks amazing. I wish I got it and I cannot wait to see the sets that we'll be getting from Dominion, which I'll be covering as soon as they come out. So like and subscribe for that one, because I'll be covering anything and everything Jurassic World Dominion related. So if you want to see any of that, you know what to do. When the Jurassic World toys were available, I barely bought any. I mainly focused on the Lego because the Lego stuff was actually good, and mainly because my Parents could tell how garbage they were. <laughs> oh, brother, this guy stinks! The first ever Jurassic World toy I got was of Charlie, and eventually I realized how garbage it was as well. So we did return it, and we actually used the money from it to buy the Lego set that came with Charlie. And while on about dead things that didn't really matter in the grand scheme of anything, a oddly specific thing I remember were fake script leaks. Because I don't remember any of the advertising for Jurassic World or Fallen Kingdom. <laughs> However, I remember these garbage quote-unquote script leaks. Two specific details I remember is that apparently the Indominus Rex broke out first and then it shut off the whole entire power to the park therefore setting everything loose, which didn't happen in the movie. And I only remember the second detail because of how fake it was. It was so fake that even stupid child me could tell this guy was lying through his teeth. Apparently, in this secret trailer he saw, apparently at the end of the trailer, with this shot right here. Apparently, in this clip, in this shot, with this exact moment, a Sukumimus strolls up and eats Claire. Which... I don't think happened in the movie. 